What is good, everybody? You already know what it is, man. It's your boy, man. Let me welcome y'all checking out the channel once again. Hey, and you already know, I appreciate y'all rocking with your boy, you know what I'm saying, supporting the channel and everything. Definitely appreciate that because I know you could have been anywhere, but you chose to be here watching this video. So, with that being said, pretty sure you read the description, seen the thumbnail, all that good stuff, man. Got Cap Kings USA or Cap Kings, better known as this is my second pickup from them. Uh, lately on the scene, they've been doing a lot more drops. Um, when I got turned on to them for the couple of hats that I wanted, I think it was a actual, it was a Burgundy Yankee 99. You know what I'm saying? I think I got the pinstripe joint. I think I picked up like three from them. You know what I'm saying? Shipping was A1. Everything came how it was supposed to come. No problems at all, pretty much. You know what I'm saying? Just more of a newer site to me. But one thing I've noticed now in the game, they picked up a lot of steam. I know they're really known. They do have a brick and mortar in New York. You know what I'm saying? But as in the online game, they've been picking up a lot of steam. They've been hitting with a lot of drops. And like most places uh, since this video, I had a chance to hang out with my guys again on Views from the Vault. If you've seen me when I was on there. But a couple of times in the segment, we were saying, and it actually you know, pertains to this, a lot of places now online, no matter what they're dropping, they're selling out and they are reaping the benefits of some of that. Uh, their drops were slow at first, not a lot of repetitive drops, but I see as far as online sales now, they've been throwing their hats in the game, having like two releases a week. A lot of the smaller places, some places that don't even have online stores have been starting up online stores that, you know, have that one mom and pop kind of brick and mortar, you know, kind of like your, your my fit is, you know what I'm saying? The more the smaller side, your my fit is, your, your, your e cap cities, your four u caps, your like I think I said exclusive fitteds, uh, sports world, a lot of those type places have been killing it online. Like I said, pre COVID, you probably wouldn't have thought so, but more so after things shutting down, a lot more things getting online and buying and all that. I mean, you get it. We could go into that. That'd be like a whole nother video in itself. But they have been reaping the benefits of that. Like I said, they've been dropping a lot more frequent. Dropping a lot of low key heat, you know what I'm saying? They're they're throwing their hat in the colorways and the, the colors UVs and all that type of stuff. So they've been benefiting from that. You know what I'm saying? Now these two styles, uh unfortunately, I've had them for a couple of weeks, if not more. But you know the game, man. You know, a lot of stuff gets bumped, you know, especially if you got some high power stuff coming in. You want to hurry up and get it out so you know you guys can check it out and everything. But let me tell you something about this. If you've seen by that, so nice that I had to do it twice. This is a look on a hat that when I first saw it, um, I saw it in one interpretation to where the way they did the logo on the side patch, but then by the time I tried to jump on it, it was sold out. And I kept seeing it, but not so much as with the same side patch and the logo how I wanted it done, if that makes sense. But when we break into them, you'll get what I mean and you'll figure out what I'm talking about. So like I said, we got Cap Kings, Cap Kings USA, whatever you want to call them. We got them in the building. We got two in here. We're going to bust them open. We're going to get into them, man. So stay tuned. You know I got to hit y'all with that good intro. You know what I'm saying? But after that, we're going to tear into these. And you already know, we're going to dive deep, man. We're going to get into it. So let's go. So like I said, I wanted to hit y'all with that good intro. I'm ready to pop these open. As you see, definitely a little excited because I've been looking for these joints for a minute. Like I said, they've been dropping some places, but some places they change the side patch on them or they change the actual front logo. And when I pop these open, you'll get what I mean. I finally found them again when they did it. So definitely have to have it. All right, got the good shipping. Hey, they put it in the bag. Definitely always happy with that. Thank you for supporting US, uh, USA Cap Kings. Get 5% off your next order. Says code, I'm back. Hey, if y'all want to use that, have at it, man. You know what I'm saying? Always going to show love 5%, but you know what I'm saying? It's something. All right. And this one here, uh, no invoice, so I can't really give y'all the name of it. But, I mean, it is a Cleveland Indians joint. And there it is right there. Been looking for this forever. And shout out to my guy. Don't know. I, I know he's been busy lately. Been checking out the channel where he can. My guy snapped back. Never that. Had a chance to meet him at the LA Festival when they had the, uh, the little get together. When Yo came out. Goose came out. 
from the East Coast, you know what I'm saying? Had a chance to meet him, and we were really talking about this hat big because he actually found one there in his size that I think he wanted to cop him. This thing here, thing of beauty to me. I love the way they did the logo. I love the way they did the side patch. Two logos and side patches that I think are top notch in my opinion. I would definitely say as far as side patch, it would be top 10 for me. My top 10 is forever changing. One video, I just do my top 10 side patches that I have right now going of all time. But I love the logo, how they did the logo, how they put the um, actual Chief Wahoo inside the seat. Now, like I said, as far as with this hat, what they did, sometime I've seen it with just the C, no Wahoo with the side patch, or sometime I've seen it with the C and the Wahoo with a different side patch. But when I seen it like this put together before on the website, didn't get a chance to jump on it. Because like I said, hey, I'm just like everybody else. I don't hit on everything. But by the time I see it and get to come back to it, you know what I'm saying? I guess this is a popular look for this hat because every time this kind of variation or version drops of it, sells out like that. I think the last time I seen it, when I was going to try to pick it up, I seen it on, uh, I want to say, four U caps. And it's crazy, the story on that. When I seen it, it was like literally three, four in the morning while I was out in Vegas, actually literally walking on the strip, going from casino to casino, you know what I'm saying? Just, you know, doing my thing. And I saw it on there, had it in the cart, about to go check out, actually pressed the checkout. By the time it, you know, scanned through and everything, it came back sold out. So definitely glad to have this one. Like I said, this side patch is top notch in my opinion. Let me know what you think down below, but this is definitely top 10 for me. I love this side patch. Just the point that it has a Wahoo in the side patch, which is a definitely one of those coveted popular logo looks. A plain Wahoo can fly off of the shelves, you know what I'm saying? Your two tones, your solid colors. This is just a popular logo. Although be it a very controversial logo, but definitely a popular logo. Love how they did the front of it with the Wahoo, with the C. Got your button on top. Got your gray under. Of course, got your white guts. I love that they did that. You know what I'm saying? Kept it kind of, I won't say traditional, but just it gives a good look to the hat. You know, everything's kind of dark. You know what I'm saying? You got a little trim of the white. You got a little, you know what I'm saying? Your, your basic trim of the white on the Wahoo. You know what I'm saying? With the side patch. Like the good old school MLB. You know what I'm saying? This is just your regular uh, threading on. This is not a flat batter man or anything like that. Your basic OG MLB logo on there. Got your tonal new error. And like I said, I love the gray under me personally, myself. Like I said, it gives it that, that regular OG vibe as far as just like, you know, you got your regular color under, got your nice white guts, but then they gave it that flip because this is one of those ones, usually I say the logo overtakes, the side patch overtakes. This here, everything works off each other, which makes it a 10 out of 10 half of me. Definitely glad I was able to get it finally in the collection. This is definitely going to get some run for me. And most people ask, and I usually don't think to look at it, but this one is made in Bangladesh. Another discussion that we had when I was on views, you know, your Bangladesh, your China. I was saying I even got one from Vietnam. That was a first, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, apparently that's the thing. They come from all over and, you know, sometimes the fits do, you know what I'm saying? So, but me being a size eight, it's really not too much of a stretch. Sometimes it'll get a little slug, sometimes it won't, but pretty sure you in the game or in the beginning have that's why you got your hat stretchers trust and believe i got one it works definitely use it <laughs> so you don't think you just lost out on a hat or because where it came from it don't work out use them hat stretchers and i have heard out there there is ways to actually shrink hats too if that's your problem if the hat's running big so hey we got ways to combat everything now and next you know what i'm saying all right now this is my next one from them and like i said if you pretty much got the meaning from the whole oh, another paper. Appreciate that, y'all. But like I said, from that again, you will pretty much get the tone of where I'm going. Where I said so nice, I had to do it twice. I did. Got the red joint also. This one here, even more than a navy, it's just it, it's a thing of beauty, man. I love this. I think they've actually came out with some two tones in this joint suit. The two tones look good. I just don't like it, but like I said, because they switched up the side patch and the front logo. Now, if they can do the two tones with the same logo and side patch, I would definitely grab them. This is one of those ones, just because I dig the way the front logo and the side patch looks, I would literally like grab all of them that I can. I would get the two tones. They had a red, the navy bill, the navy with the red. Like I would get that just because I'm a big fan of this side patch and a big fan of this front logo. And as you see, being that I would vest in literally the same hat in different colorways, 
I love the way this hat looks. I love the way the colorways come off on it. You already know, like I said, top 10 side patch for me. Love the red, uh, the white C on the red um, brim with the Wahoo on it. Like I said, love the fact they got the OG MLB logo on the back. You know what I'm saying? Got your tonal new era. And of course, they stuck with everything. Your gray under, you got your white guts on here. This thing to me, top notch. Glad I was able to get both of them. The look on these things and the way you can freak this with a good outfit and some kicks. Side note, side note. I've heard everybody in my comments when I uh, actually asked everybody what they thought. And a lot of people said they would definitely like to see some of these hats with my shoes that I would rock them with. So what I'm going to do, because um, you got to understand, a lot of hats do come in here and I try to get them out as soon as I can to y'all. What I'm thinking about doing is doing every once in a while, just doing a hat and a shoe combo video, just off some past hats, but still more so releasing hats because as you see, there's a lot going on here. So like, and on the other wall here that you can't see is a lot of shoes. So what I'll do is every once in a while, I'll throw up a video of just hat and shoe combinations that I'm either thinking about wearing for the week or just when I'm popping out somewhere. Cause you know, I sometimes wear regular eight, 12 hour days. So, but more so in the future, I do have a Vegas trip coming up. Of course, I always got a Vegas trip coming up. Y'all know that. So I'll do like, you know what I'm saying? Maybe the hats I'm taking because I do choose those before I put the outfits together. So I'll show y'all maybe the hats and the shoe combinations that I'm taking out there just to do something a little different, man. I want to show y'all how I'm rocking it because, you know, a lot of times when I do go to Vegas, I'm not really thinking of stopping and posing and taking too many pictures. I do sometimes, but sometimes I don't. So like I said, I'm going to try to change it up for y'all. Then y'all can let me know what y'all think and, you know what I'm saying, how y'all feeling about it. Then if so, we keep it going. But like I said, I got a lot of positive feedback. A lot of people wanting to see the shoes and the hats. So I'm definitely going to pull the trigger on that. The people have spoken. And like I said, I'm here for y'all. So that's what we're going to look at doing. Going to start working that in in between some of these hat drops and just giving y'all, you know what I'm saying, more so dropping probably two videos a week now. So you guys asked for it. I'll listen. We're going to work that out. So like I said, back to the main story. You got your Wahoos, you got your Cleveland Indian joints. Let me know what you think about these. Like I said, they do pop up some places, but not all the time with the same side patch. This side patch with this logo, definitely 10 out of 10. Hit these out of the park. Like I said, be on the lookout. I don't know if some people did cop these. You didn't get a chance to cop them. They do pop up on a lot of sites. So for the most part, you want my opinion, just stay on the lookout. Because like I said, these do drop randomly on different sites. But these definitely are winner in hand. Let me know down below if you was able to pick up these. If you did pick them up, let me know where you picked them up. You know what I'm saying? Cap Kings for you, Caps, wherever you have had a chance to cop. Let me know what you feel about the side patch and this logo together. Because to me, definitely 10 out of 10, man. Definitely glad I got my hands on them. And like I said, me and myself, I'm going to be on the lookout for these two-tone joints. So that's all I got. Like I said, USA Cap Kings or Cap Kings. Got the two Wahoo joints, man. Definitely love these. Like I said, Shout out to my guy, Snapback, never that, because he knew I was waiting on these things, man. He was actually helping me look out on a couple of joints that dropped on some places. Like, I tried to cop from Exclusive Fitted. They shut it down. You know what I'm saying? I guess they oversold and actually let me buy it, but then later canceled on your boy. So, but still, shout out to them. They look out for the kids. You know what I'm saying? So, shout out to my guy, though. Hopefully, he get to check this out. Like I said, I finally got one. I know he got his. Like I said, hit me in them comments. Other than that, I'm going to jump up out of here, man. I appreciate y'all rocking with your boy. Like, share, subscribe, sub, all of that good stuff. Even if you don't, I appreciate y'all rocking with me and checking out the video, man. So until the next one, and you already know it's always the next one, I'm going to holler at y'all. I'm going to see y'all in them comments, man. I'm going to catch y'all on the next one. I'm up out of here.